the Joe Rogan experience. Don't get close to the bison at Yellowstone. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to get a selfie with the bison. See that video? No, is it awful? Nine-year-old kid. The whole fucking family. They had apparently got within five yards of this fucking bison. No, they... Yes. Oh, come on, And then man. The, the bison charged and a nine-year-old kid went flying through the air. The thing about the nine-year-old kid landing, though, it seems like she landed on her feet, so I'm hoping she's okay. I haven't read anything to the contrary. Okay. So in my mind... She brushed it off, and she's like, "Woo! I can't believe I flip like that." Well, I mean, it's like a you know, if she survived, maybe a broken bone would be a good reminder. Yeah, sprained ankle. I yes. want the kid to have a sprained ankle. Yes, but I just not, I don't even want the kid. I want the fucking parent to get one of those weird diseases where, like, when a twin falls down, you Bison hurt. Disease? No. Okay. It's like the mom. <laughs> here it is. We'll watch it show you. This bison just to, look at the, the newscaster. Boom! See how she lands on her feet though. Yeah. I'm, Come pre- on. I'm pretty sure she's okay. Watch this. Whoop, bang. I think she's all right. Maybe. I think she's all right. The thing is, did it trample her after? Look at these fucking assholes. This is the problem with zoos. People in, in this city life that we live, where people do not know what the fuck a wild animal really is. Yeah. You're not supposed to go anywhere near those things. We're going to find out. They have instincts to stop predation. And their instinct is to charge head forth with this fucking 200. With the dude with a red shirt on, too. Like, didn't you watch? Asshole. Funny. Yeah, you should have juked him. You should have stepped in for the little kid, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> Over here, you fuck. I mean, right. it's a 2,000 pound gigantic animal that has to fight off wolves and mountain lions and bears. And, and yeah. you're going to have your kid five yards away from it. I, I, you know, we've had a lot of friends. The musician friends that go, yeah, I want to come out, man. I want to work Harvest. You really don't. No, you don't want to work. You really don't want to do that. Stop. I mean, I want you to, and I can make it a pleasant experience for you. I, I absolutely can. I can make it go fairly seamless, but you're going to learn some things you didn't know about yourself. Fact. 